so I am just gonna quickly make my breakfast. I'm having my shake, 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 which I always have. I'm so tired. all the time but um just exhausted this week tool scope tray scope yeah it looks quite full but honestly it's fine <laughs> it'll all mix together I'm gonna use these flavour no Flav, flav drops, flav drops, flav drops, they're flavour drops. I think a lot of companies do them so they've had to come up with a weird name. This one's vanilla, it's very vanilla -y. so I'm just gonna do like, I think this everything thing says like seven drops so that's seven but I know I'll need more than that because I like it very sweet. And then, I think I'll make it into a vanilla latte today. And how I do that is with my fave uh, decaf coffee. Because I try my very best not to drink caffeine. Because it sends me into a frenzy. Makes me very anxious. Even though when I first drink it, I love how it makes me feel. Get so much work done once I've drank coffee. I would say it makes me more awake, but it makes me like super duper productive. I'm normally doing like four things at once and I'm getting them all done, you know, to the best of my ability. But then afterwards, I feel like it's just so it's not really worth it. So there is my shake. I am going to blend it up. Zzz. I'm just back from work. I went for a little walk after work because I was supposed to go to the gym. It was supposed to be leg and glute day, but I feel terrible. I feel I feel rotten. I've got a really bad headache. And my whole body is just sore. Get a grip. So I am still doing this what I eat in a day. I just had that Huel shake that you saw me make earlier. I didn't have a shake until two. That was the first thing I ate because I was just feeling bleh, bleh. so it's like it's lunchtime, nearly dinner time, but I don't know when I'm gonna eat again. I'm gonna try and make a vegan spaghetti bolognese tonight, so if I do that, I'll show you. Before I do that, I need to sort this mess out. In particular, this. <sighs> Does anyone else just leave dishes to soak? Okay, so that did not take as long as I thought it would. Looking a little bit more organised than before. Yes! Onion! That's it. If you go to Morrison's, you can get their own make of uh, meat free rinse, and it is suitable for vegan. I'm going to use this, and I'm going to be extremely lazy and use a pre made bolognese sauce, which I would never normally think to do. But I saw this on offer for a pound in Morrison's, and I thought I'll just check and see because it's bolognese, so I thought it might have like beef stock in it. So, yeah, as far as I'm aware, this is going to be a tasty vegan bolognese sauce and all I'm going to do is add an onion. I'm just going to fry off an onion, chuck the mince in, chuck the sauce on and then have it with spaghetti. So sorry it's not very exciting but that's how we do on a Wednesday night when you've got a thumping headache and you are not really into life. I'm going to add some of these for good measure and 
get some of these. Um, wait. Some of this. Look at my eyes. That's not even from chopping the onions, that's just from cooking them. I'll never make it to Master Chef. Now that I've started cooking, I've realised that I'm actually quite hungry. So I'm going to make a salad. I'm going to have um, rice. Now I've got a cup of rice here. I'm going to heat that up. Some of this Morrison's sweet and crunchy salad. On it with my favourite dressing, which is another Morrison's one. Thousand Island. It's lovely. I like the hot rice with the crunchy salad. That's my little salad. Gonna munch on that now. This is, I'm so glad I remembered about this um, salad dressing because it's the best. I love salad. Don't feel like I've got much to say today. Like, have one of those days where I just think everything in my head and just. Feeling a bit. You can say I'm feeling low. I just feel so, 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 so tired. There's no explanation as to why. Mum told me to take B12, but I already take that. And a multivitamin. And iron. And I have nutritional yeast, which I think has B12 in it as well. I think I might be due on my. Uh, period might be something to do with that. Sorry if that's TMI. This salad though is like giving me life because I put the rice at the bottom so now I've eaten all the crunchy or mostly the crunchy healthy bit and then I'm getting to the good stuff and they're still dressing down there. I suppose you could say life is good. So I had my vegan, vegetarian spaghetti bolognese. It wasn't the best. The mince was like, the soya stuff's really chewy. I mean, it's fine. But I think as a meat substitute, I would rather just not have meat. I would rather just have stick to having beans and vegetables and rice um, and after I've got loads of leftovers so I will eat it, I will eat the rest of it, it wasn't that disgusting it's just like I say a bit chewy so now it's a bit later and um, like I said because I'm due on my period I'm feeling a bit like I want something sweet and stodgy so I'm going to have some um, porridge, porridge oats, this just little sachet that I have kicking around I'm gonna make it with some soya milk, boom, um, and just have that as a little kind of snack, my last kind of meal of the day. So that concludes my vegan what they eat in a day. Not very exciting, but I know like it's nice just to be nosy and see what other people eat, even if you don't get tips. Sometimes you just want to be nosy, don't you? And I don't blame you for that, and I don't judge you. So, if there's any vegan foods that you have tried that you think I would like, please leave them in the comments below, and I'll be sure to give them a go. Ah, it's hot. Enjoy this. Mm, carbs. <laughs>